quite early. It's currently 6.15 and we're gonna get ready to go on a run. <laughs> currently 6 25 and we need to get dressed i think i'm just gonna wear this really big oversized fsu t-shirt with these gray biker shorts from target and then for shoe choice my on cloud nova sneakers <laughs> It's 6.34 and here's a fit check. Comfy, but still kind of cute. We gotta get pumped for going on a run. <laughs> it's 6.47 and we made it to the location of where I'm going to be running. I get on the trail, guess what? My headphones freaking die and I am so mad. So I had to walk back to the car so I could put them away. I'm literally so freaking mad. That is like the worst thing that could happen this morning, but it's fine. We're just gonna make do and we'll do a little bit of karaoke. <laughs> We're 0.5 of a mile in. I have walked, but like I haven't went on a run in a really long time. So I'm gonna be walking a lot. <laughs> I'm literally dying. We just hit one mile. I'm walking again. We're 1.76 miles in in 28 minutes, which is honestly pretty good for me. I'm not complaining. Two miles is done. <laughs> we made it back to my car and I am so tired. I finished my two miles in exactly 30 minutes, which honestly for me is really good. I think the last time I went on a two mile run, I did it in 36 minutes, which timing does not matter whatsoever. But as long as I am proving every time I go on a run, that is most important to me. And I'm honestly just so proud of myself that I cut it down by six minutes. That is a very big difference. Cutting my time down by six minutes is such an achievement for me and I just feel really good right now. We're at Publix because I need to pick up breakfast because what I want, I don't have at home. So we're making a quick pit stop to pick up some yogurt and some other goodies. This is literally the Publix that I come to and I don't even know where the yogurt is. Ah, uh, I found all of it and you guys know how much I love my Chobani yogurt, but I just tried one of these and I absolutely loved it. I don't know if it was the strawberry or the mixed berry. I think it was mixed berry, so I think I'm gonna get this pack. I'm only getting these two things, so let's go check out. We're out of Publix, but I wanna explain this kind of funny thing that just happened. So I go to the cashier and she notices the camera in my hand and she goes, really nice camera. And I was like, thank you. And she was like, do you vlog? And I was like, yeah, I do actually. And she was like, that's really cool. And then she was like, what's your YouTube name? And I was just like, Emma Marie. And she was like, well, I'm going to follow you now. And I was like, okay, thanks. <laughs> Have a great day. <laughs> Those type of interactions make me so happy. So let's make some breakfast. <laughs> this looks so freaking good. I cannot wait to eat this, but we have one more thing to make. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
yum this looks so good on today's menu for breakfast we have a half drinking iced water one egg and then some yogurt with bananas and granola When I did go to Publix, I did get the pack of four of mixed berry, but I did not know that they had banana cream as a yogurt flavor. And you guys know how much I love like banana pudding, banana bread. I love anything banana. So I had to get this, just a singular one and try it. So for today, I went with this one instead of the mixed berry. And then I just added some granola and bananas to it. That actually is pretty good. I rate it like a 8 out of 10. I think my favorite flavor so far is definitely mixed berry though. It is beautiful outside and 88 degrees. So guess what that means? We're going swimming, laying out, and having a pool day. So let's pick out a bikini. I think for today, we're just going to keep it simple and do black on black. Let's grab a book. And uh, right now I am currently reading every last word. No, because I'm so excited right now. Oh my gosh. The sun is out and I am ready to go swimming. my pool so much enjoy the fruits of life instead of chasing coins I look a little crazy. This is what my hair looks like always after like getting out of the ocean or like the water. It's just a mess. But I've been out here for about like an hour and a half and I definitely have gotten some sun. I've just been laying on my stomach so my back is a little bit darker than my front. Just because I feel like it's just so much more comfortable to lay on my stomach than my back. I don't know. That's just me. A lot of you guys do ask for my tanning routine and I'm just gonna be pretty straightforward. I don't have a routine. There is nothing spectacular to how tan I get. I don't use any products except for sunscreen. That is literally the only thing that I use. I just tan really easily. Mom and my sister are both the same way. We could sit outside for an hour. We'll get burnt. That burn turns into a tan. Like that's just how it works. So yeah, I'm sorry to the people that always ask me like hoping that I use like a fancy like tanning lotion or something. I don't. I just lay outside and I let the sun do its magic. <laughs> You guys don't understand how happy the sun makes me. <laughs> but anyways, I am done laying out for the day and also swimming. But we're gonna jump in the shower and basically just get ready for the day. And yeah, that's like the last step to this perfect summer morning. That was the best shower of my entire life. It was an everything shower, so I shaved, I exfoliated, washed my hair, washed my face. It was much needed. I don't really have any like special plans for the rest of the day, so I just put on this sweatshirt. And I don't even know if I'm gonna do like heavy makeup, like my everyday look. I think I'm just gonna keep it pretty natural just because I like wearing no makeup. <laughs> but we are going to be doing my skincare routine. For me, I always have to double cleanse no matter what I'm using. All my stuff is literally packed because I just got home yesterday from a family vacay. And so all of my skincare is literally packed away.
So guys, that concludes my perfect summer morning and all I really have to say is that I'm so happy with how I spent my morning. I feel really good and it definitely was super productive. So I want you guys to comment down below what your perfect summer morning looks like because I, I just wanna know, I'm nosy, okay? <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I'll see you very soon back with more videos. Bye guys, mwah.